What is up world? Today is Monday and we are vlogging. We are starting this bad boy early. Got a lot of tapings this week, so. Think you found something? Wait, no, we really have a second That'll work. Let me see. It won't it won't reach? Oh, then it then it won't fit. Carlos putting the the Ultima, that's the the one with the door. Putting this. What up Carlos? Yeah, so we got plenty going on. The, the Corolla just left. That's the one with the breathalyzer. I would have got that, but I just started taping. Doing some stuff to the Evo. And yes. Got me a nice little Vortex generator. See that? That's the Vortex generator for the Evo. But it's the wrong color. It's phantom black and my roof's gloss black. So I gotta sand it down and paint it. So that's the motivation for today. And here's the parking lot. Packed. This is the front. I got my Vortex generator and painted it, I squeezed it in the booth. Let's go check it out before it somehow gets messed up. Not looking good. All right, YouTube, today is Wednesday, and we are vlogging, and we got a bunch of stuff done. I know sometimes it looks like we don't get stuff done here, but stuff for done. Let me flip this bad boy around and show you what we got going on. All right, so right here is the Nissan Altima. It's the one with the door. So it's all put together, almost all cleaned up. Just letting it sit right now, and then we're gonna get it detailed. Did the fender, replace the fender, new mirror, front door, and Blended the rear, and I think blended the quarter too. So, uh, very well. Oh, and the wheels too. Got the wheels refinished. But yeah, now it's for detail. Then we got over here, Mr. Vicky. What's up, Vicky? Say what up. Throw it up. Throw up the, throw up the peace sign. All right, so we got the, he is working on the 370. We got the bumper, the side skirt. I call the rocker. And we got the quarter. So then we're doing the suspension. Got all the suspension stuff that's getting done. Parts of this are on. This is the Civic Sport. Got the rear door. All bodywork done. Ready for primer. New front door shell. New fender. So this is next for paint. And then this one's all painted. This is the TL. Carlos, say what up. Tomorrow's tomorrow's joke Thursday. So yeah, we replaced the door, uh, did the rocker repair with the replacement of the rocker, um, fender, did the rear door, did the hood, I believe, front bumper. So just putting it together. I don't know if we did the front bumper. I don't know, maybe, but. Yeah, the accent was probably here, so no, no front bumper. And we got the CRV. No, it's not CRV. This is a Rev. Fuck. And we got the Toyota Rev 4 already. The door's somewhere, but the quarter's on. Everything's in primer, so this is just to sand down and get this one ready for paint. Got beauty in the bed. Let me show you my new. Every week I gotta do something into this. So we put the vortex generator. Yeah, last week was the lip. Did the front lip. This week is the vortex generator on top. So that was my little modification this week. Next week is the, I don't know what they call it. 
the the gurney the gurney for the wing that's what's going down we got the maxim over there what is up world today is thursday and we are vlogging we are checking out what we got here got the ultima this one with the door and cleaned up say what up big a we got the 370 it's an angel yes, sir. do you think the wheels bent because I just tried to order it and uh, it's discontinued. And then the company they want me to get it from, no good. What the hell? The only way to prove that is putting in the machine. Yeah. Put it on the machine to get balanced and they could see how bad it is. It might be scuffed with a grinder and. All right. I think it's. Repainting the wheel, but it might be alright, but only the machine will tell. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Then we got this bad boy on the floor. Parts are coming soon, but it was taking up the lift. We need the lift, so it's over here. On our, on our man-made, uh, I don't know what you call it, little rig. What up? Let me see. That's a Nismo spare? <laughs> Look at that. That's nice. What is up world? Today is Friday and we are vlogging. What are we doing today? Okay, we are putting together the Rev4. So the man of the hour, Mr. Carlos. Carlos repping the black shirt today. But right Carlos? What happened, to, what happened to the joke? No joke? No joke. No jokes. But it's okay. <laughs> no clean jokes. Okay. So, we're putting this bad boy together. Let me find a good spot. And that's our motivation. you into the body shop industry like you know you could have been doing so much stuff what got you into it and then what, what like got you to really perfect it because you're really good you know uh, what well, body work I started out of nothing I first did mechanic oh, okay and then when I moved to Florida there was so much mechanics and they're like hey do you want to do body work I was like all right I learned body work and there I am I like yeah because and then the buffing what, what, what how'd you buffing I told myself yeah yeah because i burned a lot of cars in the beginning <laughs> so i used to grab the doors that were from like you know the accidents yeah and after work i would grab some compound and just practice on the old doors to that's see. and then that's how i got it that's the crazy thing about this body shop industry a lot of it's self-taught yeah like i taught myself how to paint well off of going off of youtube and all that stuff and yeah. you just get over obsessed and try to perfect it because you know how it's supposed to come out yeah. and then once you start putting it out to like a professional uh level, level yeah. then then you start you know really you, it. yeah yeah you get hooked and you're like oh man i could get paid for doing this stuff well actually looking at a car when it's like all right and yeah. then when it leaves how it, you 
So for everybody out there, you, you don't have to go to school for this. You can learn it off the street. So. And probably 98% of this is everybody learned off the street. That's the best way because you learn, you learn once, you learn the hard way. <laughs> I guess the best way to go to school and then get put into it, but yeah. To each his own, you know. Everybody has different starts, but we all make it to the same finish. So that's how it is. There's no, there's no one way to do things in life. So there you go. A little bit of, about Carlos. All right, so that is it for this week. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching our vlog and spending all your time Saturday morning. If you uh, watch our vlogs when they first come out or throughout the week, thank you. We'll be back next week with more stuff. So like the saying goes, like, subscribe, and comment. Love your feedback. I love looking at the analytics. So. I will right, we'll see you guys next week with more cool stuff. We're going to keep capturing this stuff and we're going to keep filming stuff. So thank you and see you next week.